uh, one of the key findings in the group of retired professional footballers is that 25 to 35% of them report some mental health problem related to anxiety, depression or distress. In the group of current players, we found that those who suffered from three or more severe injuries during their career were three to four times more likely to report mental health problems than the group of current players that did not suffer from a severe injury during their career. So of course we want to raise a self-awareness about mental health in professional football and professional sport, but most importantly we want to develop and implement some preventive and supportive measures for the player in order to empower their mental health and also to increase their quality of life.